Is Barcelona trying to sell Frankie de Jong in January? Who will choose Xavi in place of Lewandowski, Ansu Fati, Ferran Torres or Memphis Depay? Why does Dembele short on his vacation and join Barcelona training session earlier? What does Klopp say about Messi and his World Cup campaign? Why Barcelona's Copa del Rey opponent Intercity has changed stadium for the match against Barcelona? How does Barcelona going to get financial boost from a former Barcelona player? And where does Barcelona stand in Mukhaya Codil? So all of these news guys we will find out in this video. So let's get start with it. So hello guys welcome back to Curious ID. So the first news is regarding obviously guys is Frankie de Jong and his saga. Whenever the transfer window is near or transfer window is going on the Frankie de Jong story comes back. And yesterday some reporters and some uh, sources have revealed that uh, uh, might Barcelona sell Frankie de Jong in January to get that financial boost but the news is not the whole truth guys it's uh, just assumption from the close person from Frankie de Jong it's nothing from the Barcelona side that they have uh, something uh, planning similar like to that so this is about the Frankie de Jong story there is a nothing like that and also Frankie de Jong is does not want to leave Barcelona in January or in summer so there is a no chance key Frankie de Jong is leaving in January so this is the real truth about that story which uh, running uh, around uh, running uh, running on from uh, yesterday but the real truth is that he never wants to leave uh, Barcelona in January and nothing from the club side uh, the indication is nothing uh, like that that Barcelona want to sell uh, Frankie de Jong in January. So, this is the uh, real truth behind it. Moving on to the second news, guys, is about obviously the conundrum of uh, uh, who will start in place of Lewandowski against Espanyol because we all know that Lewandowski is suspended for three matches. So, now the striker uh, choices of uh, Xavi would be Memphis Depay. Ferran Torres and Ansu Fasi obviously is the option but uh, who will choose Xavi uh, personally I, I, I will go with you can say uh, Ferran Torres because he, he play, plays really well in that false nine role and a couple of times he delivered also that uh, but the effectiveness of uh, Ferran Torres is uh, only the major you can say concerning thing uh, because he runs uh, very well he, he occupied that position very well he, he does link up very well but the final output of Ferran Torres is not that great whereas Ansu Fati is also can be the choice because he also really well in that position and the maneuvering and he also has that speed uh, which, which is uh, beneficial for Barcelona's uh, number 9 duty and also Memphis Depay we already know that he couple of times play there so he also good in that area so let's see who will chase Xavi as a number 9 role against Espanyol moving on to the next news guys uh, Dembele joins Barcelona's training two days earlier uh, as per the schedule time so he short on his vacation and he committed to the club and giving his all in the, in this second uh, phase of the season whereas uh, Kunde will join Barcelona tomorrow as uh, Wednesday because uh, both are scheduled to join on Wednesday but Dembele joined two day earlier while uh, Kunde will be joining on Wednesday moving on to the next news guys is about Klopp and Klopp has praised for Messi and his World Cup uh, campaign he said I have never seen a player like uh, Messi and uh, it's a pleasure to watch Messi at this age and he also said that uh, the deserving team win the final and this is the one of the best final and he has uh, seen Messi as the best uh, so, this is what Klopp said about uh, Messi and his campaign and Argentina's uh, World Cup winning uh, run. Moving on to the next news, guys, is obviously about Mukayako deal, guys. And uh, Mukayako rejects 5 million f uh, salary demand uh, from, uh, you can say, Borussia Dortmund. He rejected it and he is asking from around 7 million. And where Barcelona stand is, is Barcelona also not in the favor of uh, giving the 7 million salary to Mukayako. And uh, we all know that uh, there is a multiple uh, Premier League club also are interested in Mukayako and uh, the one is Chelsea, obviously. So if uh, Barcelona is uh, very clear that if uh, uh, we are going into the transfer war, then Barcelona will move out from this deal because Barca can't stand in that, uh, that scenario because we all know the Barca's uh, financial situation. So they made clear to Mukayako's agents that uh, if there is a tra transfer war, then uh, Barca will move out from uh, or is, you can say back out from that deal. So Barcelona only interested if player 
मेक टू मेक एफर्ड टू साइन बार्सिलोना इन समर बिकॉज एज पर द इंडिकेशन ही रिजेक्टेड बरुस्टर डोटमन सेली रोफल सो ही डेफिनेटली वॉन्ट्स टू गो एज अ फ्री एजेंट इन समर ट्वेंटी इंडिकेशन फ्रॉम प्लेयर साइड ऑल्सो सो दिस इज द स्टैंड ऑफ बार्सिलोना इन मुखा एखो डील नाउ लेट्स मूव ऑन टू दी नेक्स्ट न्यूज एंड नेक्स्ट न्यूज इज अबाउट गाइज फिलिप कॉटिन्यू हाउ फिलिप कॉटिन्यू विल बूस्ट बार्सा फाइनेंशियल सिचुएशन because Aston Villa is now considering to sell Felipe Coutinho and as per the agreement Barcelona will get a future sale 50% of future sale so that's a uh really good uh, for barcelona but uh, there is a not much you can say financial boost because uh, i think western um, uh, villa not get uh, more than 20 million for philip coutinho as per the current market value and so barcelona will get uh, uh, about 10 million so that's the news about how barcelona is going to get from uh, uh, Philip Coutinho deal uh, and moving on to the next news is guys obviously the Copa del Rey match against Intercity so Intercity will not play at their own stadium and they will uh, play at Rico Perez stadium where the capacity is 30000 where their own stadium the capacity is only 3000 so for the much more crowd and to watch so many uh, people uh, they uh, decided to change the venue for the game against Barcelona in Copa del Rey so now match will be played as played at Rico Perez stadium where 30000 people can watch <laughs> that match so this is about the all the barcelona news uh, today guys so if you like this video guys don't forget to like share subscribe and till then guys wiscal bar